works and the normal situation is if you pile them up, you start with the, sm uh, the big ones at the bottom and the smaller ones at the top. Here it's the other way around. The smaller ones at the bottom, the big ones on top, just to make sure that they can break all the waves coming in. Um, if you go outside, I don't know whether the wind is too forced that I can uh, speak outside. Uh, there's a, a thin red line, that's the level of the water in 1953. This is the level that the uh, barrier has to be closed if the wind is coming from the wrong direction. But it can happen that they close it and it's closed for 10 minutes and the wind changes, they have to open it again. Because the Eastern Shelf is a nature park and uh, all the environment has to be um, yeah, conserved. Uh, the normal water level, the high tide, you can see it on the, on the pier itself. It's the dark green, so now it's almost the highest level they reach. This is the scale of both four. Now it's force uh, four, so it's, it's what we call a small breeze. Uh, up on the, one of the piers is a wind bag, and that catches the wind, and then you can calculate how hard the wind blows. On the screen over there, you can see a red dot going from the North Sea into the Eastern Shelf, and this is the current speed of the water.